Hello my dear friends and welcome you to my tutorial on queuing theory or waiting line theory. This video is a little longer but after watching this video you should be able to solve almost all type of problems in queuing theory. So let's start. Our question is a motor garage has only one mechanic specialist in high speed cars. The number of customer with high speed cars follows poison distribution with mean arrival of 10 customers per hour. Customers can wait if there is a queue and attend it in first come first serve basis. And the time taken to attend a customer is exponentially distributed with a mean of 5 minutes per customer. The first we have to calculate the utilization parameter also called the traffic intensity. Second probability that the queuing system is idle. Third average time mechanic is free in an 8 hour working schedule. 4. Probability that 4 customers in there in the garage at a given time. 5. Number of customers in the garage. 6. Expected number of customers waiting for the service. 7. Expected length of non-empty queue. 8. Expected time a customer spends in the queue. 9. Expected time a customer spends in the garage. And finally, probability that the customer shall spend more than 10 minutes waiting for the mechanic service. As well, these are long list of problems, but after solving this, you should be able to solve other type of problems also. So let's start. So let's proceed to the solution. According to the given data, we have lambda or mean rate of arrival of customers is 10 customers per hour and mu or average rate of service of customers is 60 by 5 or 12 customers per hour. So solution of question number 1, utilization parameter or P is given by lambda by mu which is 10 by 12 or 0.83. Solution of 2, probability that the system is idle is given by P0, P stands for probability equals to 1 minus lambda by Q which is 1 minus 10 by 12 equals to 0.16. Solution of question number 3. Average time a mechanics is free in a 8 hour day is given by P0 into number of hours. So P0 was 0.16 into number of hours is 8 so which is 1.33 hour. The mechanic is free out of 8 hour schedule. Solution of 4. Probability of having 4 customers in the system or in the garage is given by Pn equals to 1 minus lambda by mu into lambda by mu whole square equals to 1 minus 10 by 12 into 10 by 12 whole square. So that is equals to 0.115. Solution of question 5. Expected number of customers in system. So which is given by Ls equals to lambda divided by mu minus lambda equals to 10 divided by 12 minus 10 equals to 5 customers. Solution of 6. Expected number of customers waiting in the queue which is given by L of Q equals to lambda square divided by mu into mu minus lambda which is equals to 10 square divided by 12 into 12 minus 10 which is equals to 4.16 customers. Solution of 7. Expected length of a non-empty queue which is given by LQ dash equals to 1 divided by 1 minus lambda by mu equals to 1 divided by 1 minus 10 by 12 which equals to 6.02 customers. Solution of 8 expected waiting time in Q which is given by WQ equals to lambda divided by mu into mu minus lambda that is 10 divided by 12 into 12 minus 10 which is equals to 0.416 hours or 0.416 into 60 that is equals to 25 minutes expected time for each customer in queue. Solution of 9 expected time of a customer spends in system that is given by WS equals to 1 divided by mu minus lambda that is equals to 1 divided by 12 minus 10 equals to 0.5 hour or 30 minutes overall out of which 25 minutes in queue and 5 minutes in service. And finally solution of 10 probability that a customer is waiting 
for more than 10 minutes which is given by p into e, e is the base of natural logarithm to the power minus t by ws. So our p or utilization parameter was 0.83 into e to the power t is 10 given in question more than 10 minutes and ws we just calculated is 30 minutes. So 0.83 into e to the power minus 10 by 30 equals to 0.594 is the probability of a customer waiting for more than 10 minutes. So that's it. So friends this was my video. So how was the video? Let me know in the comments below. I will upload more videos in the series. So don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. So that when I upload my next video, you will get an email if you subscribe. It takes a lot of research and effort to make a video like this. So please appreciate my effort by liking the video and please share the video. By sharing the knowledge, we may help someone else. So thanks for watching. See you in my next video. And still then, stay connected by subscribing.